James Chadwick was born on October 20th, 1891, in England to a poor family. Chadwick began studying in Victoria University in Manchester in 1908, and in 1910 he was working in Rutherford's laboratory on research projects. During the time in the university, Chadwick struggled with financial difficulties until he received his master's in physics at age 21. After, he went to work in Geiger's laboratory in Berlin, Germany, but World War I broke out and he was detained until the war was over. After World War I, Chadwick returned to England and continued his nuclear research in the Cavendish laboratory. At this time, many scientists, including Chadwick and Rutherford, believed that there was a possibility that a particle that had no charge could be located in the nucleus. Through the 1920s, Chadwick experimented in his free time in order to prove the existence of the neutron. And in the year 1932, Chadwick learned of the work of two other scientists in Paris, Frederick and Irene Juliet Curry, who believed that they managed to eject protons from a sample of wax by bombarding it with gamma rays. Chadwick didn't believe that gamma rays had enough energy to eject the protons of wax, but the notion that wax was hit with sufficient energy to eject the protons was convincing. Thus, Chadwick concluded that the wax was hit by neutrons as polonium decayed. With this knowledge, he experimented with polonium and wax and measured the protons' behavior. Protons behaved in the same exact manner as if they were hit by an electrically neutral particle with the same mass as a proton. With this discovery, Chadwick won the Nobel Prize in Physics in 1935 for his discovery of the neutron. The discovery of the neutron changed the course of chemistry and physics. It meant that neutrons can collide with the nucleus, so it increased the atom's mass, and by the process of natural beta decay, which was the emission of an electron from the atom's nucleus, would then convert the neutron into a proton. Also, with this discovery, it showed that neutrons could be used to split heavy atoms or atomic fission, releasing massive amounts of energy. This can be seen in nuclear reactors or in nuclear weapons. Chadwick became one of three men who were able to access all information about the Manhattan Project during World War II. He was present at the Trinity test on July 16, 1945, which was the first atomic bomb that was ever detonated. 19 years later, James Chadwick died at the age of 82 on July 24, 1974.